to Nick as a starter. Nick Hello. Thanks, Mark. Hi, Mikhail. What are your, your views on, on that? Pretty good way to bounce back from the Liverpool defeat. Yeah, really important to, to win and bounce back, as you mentioned. Um, yeah, with a game that had different phases in the first half, we were able to take the game where we wanted, but um, but without really threatening and hurting them enough. Um, we lacked some urgency and, uh, and some composure in the final set uh, to deliver better balls, uh, more composure on our on our finishing action because we didn't have hit the target enough with the attempts that we had and the second half uh, we had to maintain and be impatient not to lose any structure in our play because we were controlling them quite well but uh, but we needed to to thread much more certain spaces and I think we did we scored the two goals and and after that the game was more in in our control yeah it was, it was a very poor miss from Oba wasn't it towards the end of the, the first half but two great finishes by Bakaya and, and Gabby Martinelli what, yeah. what do you feel for Martinelli well, the, the finish and the combination from, from Bukayo and again, the composure that he showed inside the box to place the ball in the right um, area, great. And Gabby's uh, run as a great movement, uh, the delivery from Tommy as well. And uh, the technique, it's, uh, it's so tough when the ball is flying over your head to keep that ball down and, and have that, uh, that quality to finish, it's uh, impressive. Thanks, Nick. Rob? Yeah, hi, Mikhail. Um you know, when you see, obviously last week was a very chastened experience with some of those young players, but when you see Nuno, Emil, Bakayu combining for that first goal and, and Tommy and um, obviously Gabby scoring a second, I mean, is that a real vindication? You, you, you start with these guys, you know, you might have had to make changes, but but they're, they're learning a lot this season, aren't they? And if you trust them, you have to trust them and give them confidence in, in after difficult moments. If not, it's not real. Trust and um, and I thought that they needed another chance um, and they've done it today because they showed during the week how hurting they were after that defeat and how willing they were to put it right today. Sam, yeah, just on um, Bakayo, I mean he, he came off injured. How how is he? And also, did you did you switch him? You switched him on the wings? Was that, was that a, a plan? Yeah, it was. Uh, it was an action where he said that he felt something, he wasn't comfortable to, to continue and we would have to assess him tomorrow and, and probably scan him and see if there is any injury there. Harry? Hi, Mikael. You're up to, I joined fifth now. How far and how, how far can you go and do you feel you're right in that mix for a top four place now? We go game by game. Uh, after the defeat uh, at Anfield, obviously, <clears throat> you see things in different perspective, maybe, but we've been a good run and we have to carry on going and um, and let's see where it takes us. But uh, now it's analyze this game and start to prepare the game against um, United um, as quick as possible because we don't have uh, many days. Nick? Hi, Mikel. Um, how 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 important was that goal for Martinelli? Because obviously he burst on onto the scene a couple of years ago, and he's had a slightly tougher time since his injury. He's been in and out, and he hadn't scored since May. Um, that's quite a big moment for him. It is a big moment, and I'm especially um, happy for him because how he behaves the kid. Uh, some players are respectful uh, when you make some decisions, and some players are very respectful, like he's patience, but at the same time, it's really pushy and challenging, and it makes every decision that you make even harder because he deserves uh, more. And uh, and I'm really pleased because he really helped the team to, to get the points today. Finally, Simon. Hi, Miguel. Can you just clarify what the issue was with Bukai? It looked like it was his quad or... Yeah, he felt something muscular, and, uh, and let's, see. let's see what it is. Thanks, Miguel. Thank you. Thanks, everyone. Thank you, boys.